think if they want to know one thing that makes a big difference is how much spit do you have? In other words, the saliva is your best antibiotic to control bacteria and to control the tissues in the mouth. So if you have a less supply of saliva, spit, you have challenges. And those challenges can be airway problems, they can be related to medications for allergies, Every, everybody's taking something for Excedrin or whatever they take for, for uh, their nose running and all of that kind of thing has a profound effect on saliva. Many medications that we take have that, have that ability to slow your spit down. I always check the major salivary glands whenever I see a patient. The ones under the tongue and the ones in the, in the sides of the cheek up there by your first molar. If they have slow flow in them, you know the patient's gonna have a dry mouth problem. So you need to look at that because it's gonna really impede all of your treatment. So if they're breathing through their mouth at night, if they're taking something for blocked up nose, if they have diabetes, if they have atherosclerosis with the medications and a propensity to get autoimmune diseases, you know they've got inflammation. Inflammation is, is periodontal disease is a, just another inflammatory disease to go along with many of the other ones that we have. And you need to know that starting out that it's going to impede your treatment if you can't get it under control.